Horse archery is not for the faint of heart. You require both tenacity and patience. You have to have a willingness to go very, very hard, but be soft and gentle while you're doing it. The archery that we know as North Americans is referred to as static archery. We're standing on a stable platform. The Mongols, the Huns, the Samurai, they all did it on horseback. So it's dynamic archery. It's martial arts on horseback. We shoot targets that are straight up above us in the air. We shoot targets that are beside us on the ground. And we use our imagination and have fun. The typical scoring profile for, for horse archery in competition is a combination of arrow points and tying. The closer you shoot to the bullseye, the higher points you get. The faster your horse goes down the track, the higher points you get. This garb is what you would consider that the royalty would wear in competition or display. And uh, the hat is actually more Mongolian, um, but the rest of the garb is definitely uh, of Turkish. In 2009, I just had this thought, you know what, there was a time when people shot bow and arrow horses. And so I researched it. I had to do a lot of self-studying. Um, I did a lot of research through the internet. And then I found the ancient manuals that I teach from. One was written in the 1300s in Chinese, the other in the 1600s in Arabic and translated to English. In 2009, I took second place for all of Canada with an 80-pound compound bow and open bow hunt. I have invitations to do clinics virtually across Canada and a number of them in the United States. I've been invited to Germany. I've been actually been invited to Mongolia to teach. I truly believe in balance and in any sport the athlete should be balanced. In horseback archery, in the ancient texts, they talk about the archer in practice shooting from both the right and the left sides. Horses have been a huge part of, of rural Alberta. Forever. You pretty much can't drive anywhere in Alberta that you're not going to see a horse in an acreage, at a farm. As an enthusiast for this sport, I am so fortunate to be located in central Alberta. We have more horses in Alberta per population than anywhere else in Canada. We have a lot of tremendously open-minded horse people that just love to have fun. Caspian here in Olds is kind of the center of horse archery currently in Alberta. It's just really something cool that anybody in any tack on any horse can give it a try.